Introduction to Area. Let's consider a few shapes here. Now, if we were to colour those shapes in, then we start thinking about area. We can say that it's the space inside a shape. We can also say that it's a space that a shape covers. Now, we've got a desk there and a book. And the question is, how many books cover the desk? We're going to write our answer down there. Well, let's look at the top of the desk firstly. Now, it's drawn at an angle. But if we were to look at directly on top of the desk, we'd actually see a square shape. Now, let's start moving the books to cover the desk. One, two, three, four, five, and six. So it takes six books to cover the desk. This time we've got a, a shape here. What would you call that? Looks like the uh, side of a staircase. And we've got a blue rectangle. The question is how many blue rectangles cover the shape? Well, again, let's start moving them across. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So twelve rectangles cover the shape. Excellent. Well, that concludes the lesson. I'm sure you're going to enjoy your questions regarding area.